And good evening, I'm Eric Franke. Thanks for joining us on News 3 at 10 tonight. First tonight, Madison teachers one step closer to having a contract after meeting to discuss it tonight. The night team's Jessica R. Following the developments live at the Alliant Energy Center tonight. Jess? Well, the Madison teachers ratifying their contract here at the Alliant Energy Center just before 9 tonight as difficult negotiations led to a unanimous vote to move forward. Teachers went in knowing debate over this year's contract was the most contentious it had been in years. They came out after not much discussion. I'm an elementary teacher, so I was really pleased with um, the work that they did for elementary teachers. I've been involved in this for many, many years, mm -hmm. and quite often there's a lot more objection, a lot more no votes. A few hundred Madison Teachers Inc. members voted to approve the contract they say ultimately was fair. This is a contract that gained something for everybody in the bargaining unit. High school, elementary, middle school, special ed, specials, art, music, and phi ed. Everybody gained something. They also got a small wage increase, which the MTI executive director says still isn't enough. Uh, and even though they, the state did away with the qualified economic offer, uh, there's no money for wages. And so, you know, the wages aren't for teachers what they ought to be. But teachers in Madison believe they've got a two-year contract that will keep them happy. I just appreciate what the bargaining committee did for us. Now, the contract they've approved includes a 1% base salary increase each of the next two years, with a total increase of nearly 4% each year, including benefits. Leaders of the district and the union said some of the increases were made possible by reduced insurance rates. Now, of course, that is among numerous items the teachers were able to negotiate with the district, including a deal on how many Madison teachers would teach four-year-old kindergarten should it come to the district. And Jess, we're not totally done yet. What's the uh, next uh, step here? Well, the next step would be for the Madison School Board to ratify this contract. They will discuss it at their meeting next Monday night. News 3's Jess Garf live at the Alliant Energy Center tonight. Jessica, thank you.